Today we are discussing topic is asynchronous suffix. Asynchronous suffix is used to run process in a separate thread at, at a later time. Asynchronous process is a process that executes. Slow, Navi. Navi, slow. No, no. Okay. Don't speak a little bit that much fast, okay? Slow gonna matter. Asynchronous process is a process that executes a task in the background without the user have, having to wait for the task to finish. There are four types of asynchronous uh, asynchronous apex features. Uh, one is the future method, second one is batch apex, and schedule apex, and queuable apex. Asynchronous suffix, asynchronous calling, sir. Hmm. Asynchronous calling from schedule to schedule is possible. And uh, calling from schedule to schedule is possible. And calling from schedule to batch is possible. Calling from schedule to queuable is uh, possible. And uh, finally, calling from schedule to feature is not possible. Not possible. Calling from batch, sir. Yes. Calling from batch to schedule is possible in only start and execute and finish methods only. Calling from batch to batch is possible in finish method. And calling from batch to queuable is possible in start and execute and finish methods only. And calling from batch to feature is not possible. Queuable. Call uh, in, in calling from queuable to schedule is possible, and calling from queuable to batch is also possible. Calling from queuable to queuable is also possible. Calling from queuable to feature is possible. In feature method, calling from feature to schedule is possible, and uh, calling from feature to batch is not possible, sir. Calling from feature to queuable is possible. Calling from feature to feature is not possible, and it is a show uh, chart from show scenario, real time scenarios in use which type of use, feature methods and batch effects, queuable effects, schedule effects. Uh, feature methods, feature methods uh, runs in their own thread and do not start until resources are uh, available. Common scenarios we will use web series callout, web series callout, sir. Batch effects, batch effects means uh, runs a large jobs uh, that would exceed normal processing limits. Mainly user user data data cleaning or archiving of the records. Queuable effects. Queuable effects means similar to future methods, but provide additional job training and allow more complex data types to be used. Or common synergies performing sequential processing operations with external web services. Schedule effects, schedule effects to run at the specific time. Okay, it, it will use common services daily or weekly tasks. That's it. Good. He explained very well, but uh, you can speak a little bit slow now. Okay. Okay. Thanks. <laughs>